Good morning. Mama Brownie Bear here. And so today I'm recording a video because my best friend brought to my attention a good way to lose a couple of pounds within a few days. It's called the egg diet. So we're going to try it. She's going to try it at her house. I'm going to try it over here. And basically you're eating eggs um, for, for 10 days. But I'm only going to do it for three days because I'm breastfeeding and I've been reading comments on other people's videos that their um, breast milk slowed down while they were on the diet. So I don't want that to happen to me. So I'm only going to try it for three days and see how many pounds I lose within those three days. So I went to the store this morning and basically you're eating eggs. I've seen some videos where they're eating four eggs or three eggs. I'm only going to eat three eggs. And you eat um, eggs, apples, I have my apples here, and green tea. I have my green tea. And drink plenty of water. And let's see what else can you eat. I think it was um, eggs and an apple and a green tea for breakfast. Eggs, apple, and green tea for lunch. And then you can have um, an apple... And um, I think more green tea for a snack. And then um, for dinner, you're eating oatmeal. So I have my oatmeal here in my cabinet. Uh, where's my oatmeal? <clears throat> I've seen a lot of videos where they're doing the instant oatmeal. And I don't like instant oatmeal. So I have my old-fashioned Quaker Oats here that I'm going to just use for dinner with more green tea. And I usually drink coffee in the morning, but... I'm going to skip my coffee today and I'm going to drink the green tea. Um, so I'm going to weigh myself before I start. And I'm going to show you guys how much I weigh in just a few minutes. And then we're going to get started on our breakfast. Um, I've seen this one video where um, this lady, she made pancakes. So, since I'm only doing three eggs, I'm going to use two eggs in my pancakes, which consist of eggs and cream cheese. And I just went and got some cream cheese from the um, 99 cent store, okay? Because I didn't feel like going all the way to Walmart. And I'm going to have pancakes, my apple, and my green tea. And I also got some, some lemons to go in my green tea and my water. I'm going to try to drink a gallon of water a day uh maybe more so let's uh weigh in real quick all right so got my scale out and we're gonna go ahead and see what it tells me i haven't weighed myself in so long um just had a baby two months ago so i'm just trying to lose a few pounds trying to lose this little gut that i am accumulating over here so Let's uh, step on a skip. Excuse my toes. Ooh, we 214.6. Okay. I wasn't expecting that. But so we're starting off at 214. Let me show you guys all of my stuff again. My oatmeal, lemons, my apples. I got these other apples too from the 99 cent store. I can't wait to taste those. And my green tea and my eggs. Um, and so this is day one for me. And okay, I'm back in the camera. This is day one for me. I'm so excited. As you can see, the scale said 214. Woo. Okay, so, like I said, just had a baby two months ago. So, I'm going to show you guys what's going on with my, my body. So, we have gut here and love handles that I can never get rid of. Butt that I've been trying to grow, okay? And this is another side view. So... <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> I'm finna get started on breakfast because I'm hungry. And like I said, this is day one. 
for breakfast. I'm going to try these um, pancakes. I also got light syrup. I'm just going to use a little bit of that. Um, again, I'm only going to use two of the three eggs that I'm going to eat for breakfast. And then I'll probably boil the other one. Um, and then we'll go from there. And stay tuned for day two. Um, again, I'm starting off at 2.14. If you guys have any questions, comments, uh, leave them below for me and I'll answer them. Um, I'm really excited about this because as you can see, that scale was not nice to me. And, um, yeah, we need to get, um, below the 200. That would be nice. But, um, I've heard and seen videos where people are losing like up to 20, 22 pounds in 10 days. Um, but I'm only going to do it for three for now. Cause like I said, I don't want my, um, breast milk supply to, um, slow down. So I will come back and update you guys on day two and we'll hop on the scale again on day two, see what our progress is. And then, um, I'll update you guys on day three as well. And thank you for watching the video so far. If you guys are still with me at this point in the video, I highly appreciate it. And uh, let me try to make this breakfast and eat a little bit before my baby wakes up. Because I can't get nothing done while she's up. She doesn't let me do anything. Anything at all. So, stay tuned. And we'll be back for day two's results. Bye bye. Okay, here's a quick little snippet in the video. Um, since I'm gonna try to do the um, pancakes this morning, um, and since my mom said she wanted to try it, and now my husband is talking about, oh me too. He ain't gonna eat eggs all day, but I'll make him the pancakes for breakfast. So. Um, instead of just doing my two and like I was only going to use like not even half of the block of cream cheese, I'm going to use the whole thing and I used six eggs. So everybody gets two eggs and then everybody gets uh, one foil egg since you can um, do three or four eggs for breakfast and I'm only doing three eggs. So I've already put my eggs in the blender six eggs in the blender and I'm gonna um, <clears throat> open up this cream cheese I already got my eggs over there boiling and I'm gonna cut up some apples and um, I've also seen in one video that you can add a little cinnamon to it, so I don't know if I should use I'm gonna um, cut off some of this and see. I just feel like that's a lot, you know? I feel like that's a lot of cream cheese for some reason. And Where the hell is the cinnamon? Okay. So I'm going to add a little cinnamon. Got my ground cinnamon here. Just going to sprinkle a little bit. And I heard these pancakes taste like French toast. So we'll see. Sorry if this gets a little loud.
want to make sure it's well blended. So I'm going to get a spoon here and make sure everything is kind of blending in as good as possible. And it did say that there will be air bubbles, which I have air bubbles. And they said that you could either sit here and pop them with a the knife or you can let it sit. So I'm going to let it sit for a while. It smells good. It smells like a cream cheese, basically. And this is what it looks like. I don't know if you guys can see the side. If you guys can see the air bubbles, but um, that's what we're working with. Okay. Um, got my eggs boiling and got my apples. So I'm going to cut everybody up an apple. And the one lady told us what she ate close to like the end of the video. Of course, she ate her eggs and her apple and her green tea. But she also said that she ate um, yogurt from time to time because she was doing it for 10 days. And she had turkey sausage. So since today is my first day, I don't want to be hungry within an hour so i'm gonna make the pancakes because for the next two days i have a busy morning so i won't get to make the pancakes and i really want to try the pancakes so um tomorrow i'll probably scramble all my eggs and um eat them that way with my apple and my green tea um so but for day one i'm gonna have i got some turkey sausage links Ooh. And I'm going to try those with the pancakes and my boiled egg. And I got my green tea out ready. And I'm ready to go, you know. Ready to see what three days is going to do. So I'm going to do three days in December. And then I'm going to do, excuse me, um, three more days in January before my birthday. So I can look nice. So, pray for me, y'all, because I get hungry, and I like to snack on chocolate and cookies and stuff, and that's where all this gut is coming from, and then I was also thinking of putting on my waist trainer, but I'm still thinking about that one right there. I'm going to sit on that for after breakfast and see, but... Just wanted to show you guys how I made the mixture for the pancakes. And I'm going to see how they come out once I start cooking them. So I thought I'd show you guys how I do the pancake. I um, got my first pancake going. Uh, ooh, I did not mean to do that. But I just got some butter in the skillet. And it's just like how you're making regular pancakes. You pour it in the skillet. Let it cook brown on one side and then uh, flip it over, let it cook on the other side. So I hope these pancakes come all right because I would hate to have wasted my eggs, but hey, we'll see. And then I got my eggs over here boiling. And um, that's that. Okay, so I flipped it over. This is what it looks like. It looks good. I can't wait to eat this. So, I'm going to make everybody two pancakes each. And I do have my turkey sausage over there frying up. I just put a dab of extra virgin olive oil in the skillet. Just a little bit so it doesn't stick. And this is breakfast for day one, you guys. Looking kind of crazy this morning. I'm tired, but I'm gonna have my eggs for breakfast with a couple of little things mixed up in there, some spinach and stuff. And um, 
when I come out from my meeting, I'll have my lunch. This is what we're working with so far. Look at this. This has got to go, okay? This has got to go. But uh, I'll be back for day three. Told y'all, I can't get nothing done. She woke up halfway during me preparing my breakfast. Look at her. Just woke. She won't let me do nothing. <sighs> Trying to cut up my apple. Hmm? Okay, well, breakfast is almost done, so I can eat. Good morning, guys. It's day two, and we're going to do a quick little weigh-in before I eat breakfast because I have to be somewhere at 11, so I am running press for time. So, let's see. This scale was a little weird. I know I didn't gain a pound. Because it was 214 yesterday. This scale doesn't read right unless you're on a flat surface. So maybe it'll. Let me see. See? See the difference? So, I don't know. But, I'm going to get weighed on Monday when I go to a different appointment. And we'll see, but. Alright, so I completed three days of the egg diet. And, let's see what the scale says. So, we started off at 214. And sometimes I can't trust this scale though, but let's see. It's about 213. See, when I weighed myself this morning, it was like 210. And then when I weighed myself a little while ago, it said 212. So I really need a more accurate scale. But so I don't, and I don't know where the hell this bump came from. This is very disrespectful. Um, so, I don't know what number to trust, but I did do three days. Um, next time, I'll do more. I'll do, like, five. Um, but that was my progress. So, that's my progress. Basically, I just been eating eggs for three days, eggs for breakfast and an apple, eggs for lunch and an apple. The first day, I had oatmeal um, for dinner, and then the next day, I had eggs and apple for breakfast and lunch and then i made like this type of um egg fettuccine dish which was okay i enjoyed that um and then tonight i just had like boiled egg for dinner so i managed to get through three days uh i can probably do more but i just um i'm breastfeeding so of course i didn't want my breast milk supply to um slow down so i'm gonna give it a few days rest eat healthy um and then uh i'll get back on it doing a couple of more days see how much more weight i can lose but i might have to go out and get a more accurate scale because this one right here be playing games i don't got time but this is uh how the body is looking you know a little gut still love handles just gonna hide those in these tights. You feel me? But, uh, <laughs> that's it. If you guys have any questions, drop them down below.